An old historic gem is tucked away on Leesbrook and Ledger. And photojournalist Kelvin Higgins gives us a tour of the Ledger up down sawmill. It's 1860 vintage. This is the best toy you can have. And it's about the only operating sawmill of this type on its original mill site. The original mill built on this site was in the 1790s. The mill that's here right now is probably about uh, 1860. Amazing how they used to have to do things, huh? Yeah. Well, you got a tank over here, and the water enters the tank, uh, flows down to the, the turbine at the bottom, spins the turbine, which drives our shafts, and pulls the saw up and down. We have a valve that's ran from upstairs that turns on and off our turbine. That is fabulous. All water power, too. Yeah. The mill is open two months in the spring in uh, April and May. On Saturdays from 1 to 4, and it's also open on, in, in the fall. You got to be careful because that saw can pick that entire log up. We get anywhere from 20 to 50 or 60 people during that three hour period. There's another mechanism yep. which advances the saw. Yep. Fantastic. Well, they like to see the mill work. They're, they're interested in just how the, the, the logs are processed and things like that, and how we move it. Uh, we got to do all, we bring all our wood in by hand. It's labor intensive. A lot of the work that's done around here is done by volunteer labor, and they've been pretty enthusiastic, and they just like working with the mill. It, it's a lot of fun. In the modern age where everybody is kind of glued to their computer screens and things like that, there, there's no computers involved in this. It's basic, you know, physical labor that operates the thing. Hopefully it'll be here in 100 years from now, still cutting wood. <laughs>